an exhibition that showcases spacecraft, spacesuits, and space food used during China's historic Shenzhou 7 space mission, gives visitors in Shanghai an insight into the world of space. Photographs of the dazzling view of space taken by the six astronauts from the manned Shenzhou 5, 6, and 7 missions between 2003 and 2008 spur great emotions on the magnificence of the universe. These amazing photos were taken through this small window on the Shenzhou spacecraft. Inside the spacecraft, the astronauts do the normal things anyone will do on Earth. Shenzhou 7 was China's third manned space exploration. At the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center, 9.09 p.m. on September 25th last year, the Long March CZ-2F rocket launched the Shenzhou 7 spacecraft carrying Zai Zigang, Liu Boming, and Jing Haipeng into space. The spacecraft entered the orbit and went around the Earth for a day. On September 27th, Commander Zai slipped out of the orbital module of the spacecraft at 4.39 p.m. and wandered around the spacecraft for 20 minutes. He waved the Chinese flag, acknowledging the millions of Chinese people who watched the historic moment through a television broadcast in China. After the spacewalk, the spacecraft returned home. The orbital and aft service modules separated from the re-entry module, which carried the three astronauts back to Earth. After the re-entry module entered the atmosphere, a parachute was released from the module, bringing the astronauts back to Earth safely. The three exited the module and received a hero's welcome in central Inner Mongolia on September 28. China became the third country to have completed a spacewalking activity after the former Soviet Union and America. Other captivating exhibits are the parachute used for the landing, samples of flowers, plants and seeds the astronauts brought along to space for experiment, the Chinese flag and the space suit worn by Zai during the spacewalk. The suit, which comprises a pair of gloves, is worth more than 16 million ringgit. Visitors also get a chance to try out a simulator to experience the kind of training astronauts have to go through before they are set for zero gravity. The ultimate goal of China's space program is to build a permanent space station and land on the Moon and Mars in the next 20 years. From Shanghai, Chao Haoban, The Star Malaysia.